What's happening everyone? My name is Ridge and this is what's going on here at the Fort Myers Seventh-day Adventist Church. Here at our church, we value mission. And just recently, we have appointed a new outreach director and his name is Richie. Richie is a wonderful man of the Lord and he's gonna go ahead and explain more to you about what we're wanting to do for our outreach program here at our church. My name is Richie Baltazar, and I am the new Outreach Minister Coordinator for the Fort Myers Seventh-day Adventist Church, and I am super excited to be in this position. If you are wondering what that means, it basically means that I am in charge of Outreach Sabbaths for our church and organizing Bible studies and following up with leads. Outreach is a super imperative thing for the body of Christ because we as members of the body, we are supposed to be sending out a message to the world according to Matthew 28 for us to go out and make disciples. So I am encouraging each and every one of you, yes, you looking at me right now, I am encouraging you to come and join us, come and join the Fort My Sunday Adventist Church mission to go out and reach souls that are lost, souls that need Christ, and souls that need to be brought inside of the kingdom of Christ. I'm super excited to be working with our very own Pastor Travis and our church leadership to put together a team. And if you join in that team, you will be able to know how to effectively study the Bible. And not only that, but you will be able to learn how to share your faith to others. We are going to also train you on how to um, evangelize um, in our outreach. We are going to be going out in the roads. We, we are going to be going out in our communities as well to be able to evangelize to the lost. And also, I would like to um, invite you all to join into the program that Pastor Travis has going on right now called Digital Ministries. And, you, and Pastor Travis is going to teach you guys how to do digital missionary work effectively. And if you are interested, please see me or Pastor Travis or one of our elders after church. Listen, guys, this is the time that we have to be engaging as a church because there is a lost world out there and it is up to us to go out and reach them. So listen, join in. Simple. Reach out to me, reach out to Pastor Travis, reach out to one of our elders, and we will get started on this great commission work. God bless you all. Thank you so much, Richie, for all the love and the dedication that you not only put to our church, but to also saving lost souls. And so if you're interested in joining this outreach group, I invite you to approach Pastor Travis or Richie or one of our elders so that you can get involved and plugged in to join our outreach team. You see, there are many ways to get involved in mission here at our church. One, you could join our outreach team or you can do something as simple as sharing a post from our church on your personal social media page. Just recently, our church has been very intentional about what messages we put out on our different social media platforms like Instagram, Facebook, etc. And we've made it so easy to share messages that you hear right here at our church so that you're able to share it with your friends, your family members, and whoever you decide to share it with. Here's a little taste of an Instagram reel that we've been posting every day on our social media page. Self-awareness is one of the best gifts you can give to yourself and especially the people around you. The more self-aware you are, guess what? The more compassionate you are. Everybody has their things just like you have your things. The more you can understand why other people are the way they are in context with yourself and your own self-awareness, you have a much more patience and compassion for other people, even though they may be different from you. These posts are an amazing way to not only share with other people what you're learning here at our church, but to most importantly, share the gospel of Jesus. And truly, all it takes is a couple of seconds to see the post, click share, add it to your story, send it to a friend, and that way you're able to shine your light even on the digital space. So maybe the next time you see a post, go ahead and share it and shine your light for Jesus. On the evening of July 29th, we will be having a concert from our very own pianist, Victoria. 
Victoria has been an amazing part of our church and she has shared her beautiful gift of playing piano with all of us. And unfortunately for us, the Lord is calling her to different chapters, but very good for her because she is following where God is wanting her to go. And so to support her, we are going to be having a concert on the evening of July 29. And so I hope you make it there. I hope that you're able to support Victoria, to support her ministry, and to even hear some amazing piano pieces. Following that piano concert, we will be having a church social so that we're able to hang out, have fun, and get to know each other as a church family. Before I go, I always want to remind you guys to click on our Linktree link. I'm going to put it right here. This is a one-stop shop for everything that you need to stay up to date about what's going on here at our church. You're able to sign up for our church's newsletter here. All you have to do is put in your name and your email and we'll sign you up right away. This link has the links to our Instagram page, our Facebook page, our YouTube page. So that way you're able to follow us, like our pages and even subscribe so that you're able to share this amazing content, this amazing message at the end of the day with people whom you love. And on top of that, like I said before, it's a great way to shine your light for Jesus. Well, everyone, thank you so much for joining us for church today. I wanna to personally invite you to our potluck that we'll be having right after service today. So if you're hungry after the service, please stay at our church in our church's fellowship hall. We will be having a potluck. I know we're gonna have a great time together. And friends and family, I hope that God blesses you I hope that God reminds you that you are his child, and I pray that the Lord speaks to you today. Happy Sabbath.